When you need help, when you're out of options, and you need your voice heard, better call four. I just felt so like frustrated and alone because this should not be happening. It should not be this difficult to get your mailbox key and to have access to your mail, you know. For months, a Columbus woman says she had no access to her mail after moving into a north side apartment complex. She says the property management pointed fingers at the USPS, but the Postal Service says it was not their responsibility. So she turned to Better Call 4 for help and we got results. Have you ever considered that being able to check the mailbox is a privilege most of us take for granted? It's something Kiana Fuqua's considered after she moved into an apartment complex in North Columbus last September. I picked up my key to get into my apartment and, the, and then, you know, I asked the landlord like, hey, you know, what about my mailbox key? And she told me, oh, you'll go to the local um, post office to get your mailbox key. So that's what I did. Showed them all my information. They stamped it, told me to come back in seven to 10 business day and they'll have my mailbox key for me. When that time passed, Fuqua went back to the post office to get her mailbox key, but they said, no, you were told the wrong information. We don't have a key for you. You have to get your key from the, the rental property um, where you're renting from. So Fuqua went back to her landlord. Explain everything that was going on. She said, oh, nope, that's not our issue. That's USPS issue. The back and forth with the post office and with property management continued and Fuqua was right in the middle. And someone has to be responsible. I'm not responsible. I'm just the tenant. <laughs> but says she became more and more frustrated and confused, especially after she took another look at her lease agreement. It even stated that I'm supposed to have one mailbox key and one key to my apartment. So that's when Fuqua called Better Call 4 in February. She had gone nearly five months without mail. After speaking with Fuqua on February 5th, I was also confused about who was responsible. I even asked a mail carrier who just happened to be outside of Fuqua's apartment the day we spoke. She told me it was the rental property's responsibility. And a USPS representative echoed that, telling me in a statement, we apologize for the miscommunication, but USPS does not own these boxes. Since they are considered privately owned, the building management is responsible for maintaining the box, including issuing keys. I then reached out to property management, who told me Fuqua's mailbox is a USPS mailbox, but added that they made the decision to replace all of our mailboxes from USPS to our own to avoid this issue from happening to anyone else, and went on to say Fuqua's mailbox was replaced on the 12th, and she was finally provided with a key on the 21st. So I did check with both the property management and with USPS, but still never got a clear answer as to why there was so much confusion about who was responsible for the key. I did, though, also confirm with Fuqua that she got her key. It works and she's officially able to get her mail. Now, remember, if you need help or you feel like you aren't being heard, you better call four at 614-212-4444. You can also visit our website, NBC4i.com slash Better Call 4 and tune in every Tuesday and Thursday evening at 545 to watch Better Call 4.